probably the size of them. These are rounded, so it's uh, you know they're far, they're very far apart. Probably good, you know, ten feet apart from tip to tip, but they're rounded, so you can uh, you know you can judge. Okay, if I can if I skim them and I get into the bottom of them, it's going to be no big deal. If these were real peaked, no, I wouldn't try to skim them. I would double through them or try to triple through them, whatever. But with the way they are, you can uh, carry a lot of speed them and just carry off the tops. I know what I'm doing when I come out of that corner, and that's why I start shifting up, you know, probably fourth, fifth gear through these. Make sure you're in the middle of the bike or forward, have your head over the crossbar, not too far, not back, because if you're too far back and that bike end kicks you in the butt, you're going to go over the bars, your feet are going to come off the peg. In the middle, the bike can be, you're, you're balanced, like this. If you're back here, the bike kicks you in the butt, and that's when you see people's feet come off. You gotta be in a high enough gear so you don't run out of gear. Uh, you gotta be on the balls of your feet, I feel, so you can be quick on your bike. Grip your bike with your legs and look ahead two or three whoops ahead so you know what's coming up.